Today, I will be reading you a story called I Love You, My Bunnies by Laura Driscoll. Spring had finally arrived in the forest. Butterflies flitted from flower to flower, and robins sang cheerfully in the trees. Twitter tweet, Twitter tweet. The bunny's day began just the same as always, with a soft, cozy nuzzle, a filling of bunny tummies, a tickly warm wash, and a big, strong hug. Soon the bunnies hopped off to play. Mama does so much for us. Thumper say, let's make her a basket. Thumper's sisters were excited. They all hopped to it. Russell, Russell, Trixie and Daisy searched for twigs up high. Russell, snap, Rhea and Tessie looked down low. Scritch, scratch. The bunnies wove the twigs together. Nearby, the chipmunks chittered cheerfully, but the five little bunnies did not hear them. They were making a basket as strong as their love. The basket was sturdy, but it needed something more. Flowers! Daisy cried. Sniff, sniff, pluck. The bunnies picked buttercups and daisies and lilies. Little Tessie even found some pink clover. The meadow larks chirped in the trees above, but the five little bunnies did not hear them. They were making the basket beautiful for their mama. The basket was lovely. But it needed something more. Trixie hopped off. Soon she returned with a plump blackberry. Rhea smiled. Mama loves berries, she said. Pluck, pluck, mmm. The berries were juicy and ripe, perfect for bunny tummies. Bzz, bzz, bzz. Bees buzzed amid the brambly patch. But the five little bunnies did not hear. They were filling the basket with sweetness for their mama. At last, they were done. The bunnies took the basket, that strong, beautiful, sweet basket, home to their mama. And their mama gave them strong, beautiful, and sweet right back. A big hug. We love you, Mama, the bunny said. And I love you, my bunnies, their mama replied. Thank you for watching this video. I appreciate it.